Hey everyone, in this video we're going to have a quick overview of Easy Burger, a custom brick by Blocks Builder. Easy Burger adds love to the toggle on our sidebar and full screen menus and it does this by replacing the standard toggle with a font awesome icon. Just like on our website here, our Easy Burger website, we can see our toggle icon is a burger with a nice hover effect and it opens our side menu. And the same here, we've got a bit of styling on our clothes icon. It's very cool. So Easy Burger comes with a bunch of features from being able to select uh, from a whole bunch of font awesome icons, changing the size, changing the color, uh, background color, drop shadows, even uh, defining an offset for the navigation menu. But more on that one shortly. So here we have our blocks project and our website. And at the moment I've just got the basic uh, bootstrap toggle icons here. Nothing too flash. And what we're going to do is I'm going to add the Easy Burger brick in the global area of my footer. Just do a quick search for Easy. Select my burger. And now we have our uh, brick installed. When I select my brick on the right hand panel, I'm going to see all the options where I can uh, choose to uh, select the icon that's going to be used. I can choose the icon style, um, the colors, the transition, the background colors, padding, radius, even some drop shadow effects, which is really cool. And choose a bit of styling on our close icon here. I can change the thickness from fine all the way to thickest and set a color and a hover color. And then last but not least, we have our sidebar menu offset. And I'll show you this one in action in just a moment. Okay, so um, I'm going to style on this site our hamburger icon just like we had in our working example. So I'm going to go to the icon menu here. And there's a bunch of preset icons that I can choose from. I can even, by selecting the custom FA icon option, I can actually put my own Font Awesome code in here. And you can easily get these codes from the Font Awesome website. But in this case, I'm actually going to choose an actual burger. Now, if I do a quick preview, you can see now that um, just up here, it's a bit hard to see because there's no styling yet um, that we've got our burger icon. It's that quick and that easy to change. I'm going to keep it at two rims um, and all our sizing in this brick is in rims. And two rims is quite a good size. And usually one rim is equal to about 16 pixels, just as a bit of a guide there. So my primary color here uh, for its normal state, I'm going to choose that uh, limey green color. And for my hover color, I'm going to choose uh, that uh, slightly deeper blue. There we go. I'm going to set a transition. Now the transition is the fade time between the normal state and the hover state. You can set that to none. So it changes instantly all the way up to one second. I'm going to do uh, 0.6 of a second here. I'm not going to set any background styles on this one. Uh, I don't need a drop shadow on this one. I will change the styling on my close icon. I'm going to make it a little bit thicker. I'm going to keep it red, but my hover color, I'm going to make that nice blue also. All right, let's have a look. And there we have it. We have our green hamburger icon with the blue hover. And we have our red close icon with the blue hover also. Now, there's one problem with these side menus is that our navigation text sits so high up and it's kind of in the way. Now, our little slider option will move our text further down. So I'm just going to come back to our options down here. Slide, come all the way down to our slide bar, our sidebar menu offset, and I'm going to set that to around three. Now remember, this is in rims also, so three rims, uh, and let's have a look at what that looks like. There we go, we've got a nice gap up here now, and I think that actually looks really good. Awesome. Okay, that's how easy it is to change our icons and set some styling. Um, we can very easily change our icon and it will keep all our styling. So we could change to um, vertical dots here. And as you can see, it's kept all the styling that we've chosen earlier. Um, we can even add, as I mentioned, a custom um, code here. And I know one of the font awesome ones would be, say, a clock. Pretty exciting. And there we have our icon has changed to a clock, just like that. 
Okay, that's a really quick overview of Easy Burger. It's available for purchase from the Blocks Builder website. If you've got any questions about Easy Burger or would like some help with it, please do not hesitate to contact us. Okay, take care. Have a fantastic day. Mm-hmm.